old and I come from Holland and uh, me and Noah were invited to play for the national team. So here we are now for tryouts. to come here to Indonesia and you're very excited. We just uh, had our second training of the day. Okay. How do you feel after joining the national team? How did I feel after joining the national team? Um, well, it's very exciting. I'm also very nervous. We really have to fight for our spot. Um, but the team is very nice and the practices are very good also. Just only getting used to the weather because it's very warm here. Yeah, actually the same. Um, the most challenging part is getting used to the weather, but I think day by day we'll get better. Um, we still have a week to show ourselves, so I believe in us. Were you, into, were you interested in going to the national team? Um, well, actually when I was very young, um, my Indonesian side, so my father's Indonesian fully, um, they did a lot of football, so I got to I got introduced to football since uh, a very young age. And um, I feel very close to my Indonesian roots because, um, yeah, I, I had a lot of contact with my family. So um, that's why I was really excited to play for Indonesia. Uh, for me, when I was also a little kid, I wanted to play in another country. For sure, it was always my dream. And it was more like a feeling from inside that I wanted to play for Indonesia. So I tried to have contact. It's most of the time it's cold and it's rainy, so I'm not used to it. In the summer it can be hot, but in the summer we also have vacation, so I am not used to it. No, I'm not used to it too, but uh, as if you were asking about the first training here in Indonesia with this hot weather, and I guess so, because I think it's at the midst of the, midst of the day, so the hottest moment, hottest moment of the day. Um, but yeah, it just takes time to get used to it and then it, it will be fun. So you fought a uh, struggle with this weather? Uh, yeah, but I, I think it takes time. And that's it. After a week, I think we're used to it. Yeah, exactly. What's the, the difference uh, about the training program with the coach? Is there any differences uh, between the program in this uh, country, in Indonesia, or in um, I think it's it's pretty similar to um, in Holland than in Indonesia. It's really uh, similar. Um, I think the mentality here is very uh, big. Everybody wants really wants to um, give 100 percent. So for me, I think it's pretty similar in Holland. Yeah, I think so. That it's pretty similar in Holland as well because the, everyone here has discipline, and um, in Holland. Um, Everyone plays quite fast, so you have to play fast and then go running um, and help the other players so they can pass the ball again. And just like uh, Coach uh, Mochi's point of view, because he's obviously Japanese and Japanese people also play fast, so that's kind of what he wants to learn us. I think it's quite similar to the Netflix. Stella, uh, Stella, I see you speaking with uh, your fans. Do you want to uh, learning? Uh, yes, so I'm learning now through the app Duolingo, but they only learn me fruit, so I know Juruk. Um, but I'm learning here off the field and in the field, but I'm trying, yes, but it takes time also. Can you assume Indonesian? Oh, well, actually, my father, I, as I told you before, my father's Indonesian, so I got to um, learn a bit of Indonesian already. <coughs> Family speaks Indonesian to me. And sometimes I speak Indonesian back, but most of the time Dutch, but I can understand some parts and speak. Can you describe the uh, uh, how, how you are and uh, with um, So Viving called us, and my Indonesian roots is from my father. My grandmother was born here. Um, when she was 15, she went to Holland, and there she raised our family. So again, Vivian also called me, and um, my Indonesian roots are also from my father's side. He's fully Indonesian. Yeah, um, dari Maluku, Ambon. So uh, yeah. Uh, yeah, I'm also Maluku. I heard you. You 
we've been contacting PSSE since uh, maybe one and a half year ago, yeah. So, uh, and you contact with Coach Rudi Eka. So, uh, will you tell me the process of, of that? Well, we uh, only had a short moment of contact because he uh, contacted me and then he wanted me to um, actually join the Asia Cup as well. Sadly, I did not get to it because it was a difficult process, but now here I am again. <laughs> Thank you for your time in the future. If uh, the PSSI, we call you to the national team for you maybe play for in the country of Poland, maybe Argentina for your own groups. Um, if Argentina will call me up, I will stay here for sure. Um, I like it here, the people are nice, uh, the playing is good, and I think this is where I belong. Yeah, actually, same for me. I'm if uh, the Netherlands will call me up, I'd like to stay here because um, I think actually the team is very nice, the culture, the play culture, um, how everything is handled here, I, I like it. Yeah. In the men's uh, national team, there is uh, player, one player uh, like you as uh, like a In the men. Uh, yeah. uh, like uh, do you know where they are and uh, are they faces uh, or top? If we have contact with them, you mean? Yeah. Um, no, not really. No, not really. I don't really have contact with them. I know some people because they um, play in Holland, of course, but like really personal, I don't know them. No. What, what do you know about Indonesian football before joining? Before joining, well, I was always interested. So before I got invited, I watched some matches. Um, I know that there is now not really uh, a league for women and they're trying to process and make the team better. So that's for now all I know. Okay. Okay. Thank you so much. Thank you. 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 Thank you.